We made it to Friday morning, Glads. I'm Hannah Hall. And I'm Ethan Simon, and this is your KWHS News. Before we jump into our announcements, let's head over to the cafeteria to find out what's on the menu today for Miss Betsy and her guests. Happy Friday, everybody. I got my friends here to tell you what's on the menu. Go ahead. Hey, Friday, chicken bowl. And Monday, you got hot wings. Yay, Yay. see you then. Bye. Pay your dues. Thanks, Miss Betsy, Mr. Bergen, and Miss Griggs. Students, the semester is almost over, but Miss Betsy can still process your free and reduced lunch forms, so get them in ASAP. If you need to add money to your account or pay lunch charges, you can do it in person or online from the school's website. Students, if you have not turned in a blue federal impact aid form to the attendance office, you must do so ASAP. Please get them signed and back to the attendance office immediately. Glad yearbook prices are going up on December 11th to $65. Be sure to order yours now while the price is still only $55 to reserve your school memories now. Juniors and seniors, college visits are winding down for the semester with the reps from Johnson and Wales on Tuesday, December 5th. And for those of you planning ahead for 2018, one of the first colleges to schedule visits with us is Lamar Community College on February 18th. Seniors, listen up. Here are other important graduation announcements from the Counseling Center. Herf Jones will be here on Friday, December 8th at lunch to help you order your graduation announcements. This will be the deadline for announcement orders. They will also help you place your class ring and cap and gown orders at this time. The deadline for those orders is December 21st. If you cannot place your order by December 8th, you can always go to www.yourgrad.com and take care of it online. And finally, if you are graduating in December, congratulations! Please see Miss Abeda in the Counseling Center to pick up some very important graduation information. Also, not just graduating seniors, but everyone, please be sure to check Infinite Campus to see if you owe any fees for books, uniforms, or class fees. Stop by the business office to pick up a printed statement of those fees and get them paid off so you can get your diploma on time. Seniors, remember you can buy your senior shirts next week for $15. Get yours in the cafeteria next week. When we come back, we'll have a list of holiday festivities kicking off next week, but first we're throwing it to John Christofferson for our Gladiator Sports Update. <clears throat> It's Friday, Glads, and I'm John Christofferson with your Gladiator Sports Update. Our winter sports teams kicked off their seasons last night. Let's start with scores from our Lady Glads basketball team. Our Lady Glads basketball team hit the court on Thursday night against the Lady Rangers and roped those girls in for a win. Coming up for Lady Glads is the Pueblo County Tournament on Thursday, December 7th. You can catch the ladies at home on December 12th against Cheyenne Mountain at 7 p.m. Our boys basketball team is also headed to tournament play on Thursday, December 7th on the road at Pueblo South. They'll take on Cheyenne Mountain on December 12th on the road. The wrestling team starts its season this afternoon at TCA. The match starts at 5 if you want to watch the Glads dominate the mats. Also today, our Grizzly Aider swim team jumps in the pool at 4 as they host the Fountain Valley Danes. Go get those dogs! The forensics team heads up to D20 for the Liberty Tournament on Saturday. And finally, here's Doc with our health tip of the week. Hey guys, it's Doc with your health tip of the week. This week we're talking about hydration. Yes, that means water. I know it tastes like water, but it's really good for you. Did you know that you need half of your body weight in ounces a day? So what does that mean? If you weigh 100 pounds, then you need at least 50 ounces of water every day. So that's like two large Gatorade bottles. So make sure you're getting enough water because it helps you to think better. You'll be more alert, you'll be happier, and it also helps your immune system so you'll stay healthy. So drink your water and stay healthy. Thanks, Doc. Next week, Doc will be talking about stress and final exams. Good luck to all our sports teams this weekend. That's it for our sports update. Have a great Friday. I'm John Christofferson. Now back to you, Hannah and Ethan. Thanks, John. Glads, the 180 Club is collecting canned goods and non-perishable foods to be included in their Christmas baskets this year. Items such as potatoes, canned veggies, cereal and box desserts are welcome. Last year, the 180 Club distributed baskets to 30 WHS families and would like to exceed that number this year. Bring your donations to any teacher in the math department. Donations will be collected until December 8th. If you can help, please do it. Glads, 
Starting on Monday, December 4th and going until Wednesday, December 20th, WSD3 is holding a toy drive for families in the area. If you would like to donate a toy, please bring in an unwrapped new or gently used toys to the tree in the front lobby. And now, here are your club and activities updates for Friday. Student Union is open in the library every afternoon from 3 to 4.15. Be sure you have a sticker on your ID. The Power Club typically meets on Fridays, but swing by Miss Sardinia's room to find out for sure. And the Guitar Club meets in room 2 after school with Mr. White. If you want to store your guitar until the end of the day, see Mr. White. Glad. We hate to break this to you, but final exams are just around the corner. Sad, but true. But NHS is offering free tutoring sessions every Thursday during advisory to help us out. Sign up in the library on Thursday mornings. Remember, on Thursdays, the library is only available for computer use and tutoring. Attention freshmen, Link Crew has a special study session for finals just for you. It's called Coco and Cram, and it is happening on December 18th from 3 to 4.30. Join Link Crew leaders in the science hallway. Bring your study guides and books. They will have hot cocoa and cookies to help you remember your study information. Glads, want something festive to do to get you in the holiday spirit? The Widefield Parks and Rec Office is holding its 12th annual holiday tree lighting celebration. The fun happens at the Widefield Parks and Rec building on Tuesday, December 5th from 5.30 to 7.30 p.m. Come enjoy caroling, crafts, s'mores, hot cocoa, hay rides, and holiday shopping. Heck, even Santa will be there. You can also donate non-perishable food items, unwrapped, new, or gently used toys and coats. Kickstart your holiday spirit with some holiday fun. Finally, seniors, the senior class is hosting a movie night tonight, starting at 7 p.m. in the small gym. Come enjoy Elf with your classmates. It's free to watch. There will be drinks and snacks available for a small fee. Finally, Student Cabinet kicked off their Drive Smart events on Wednesday with a convincer. Here is another video clip to remind you to drive smart. That's all for our news today. Have a great Friday. I'm Hannah Hall. And I'm Ethan Simon, and this was your KWHS News. Have a great rest of the week.